Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Brianna, AKA Hooked by Brianna. And as you can tell by today's video, I'm going to be showing y'all everything I made in the month of January, 2023. Granted, some of them I did make in like the first couple days of February, but we're gonna disregard that because I made the idea in January. And I started it in January for the most part. If you didn't want to watch like my 30 minute video that I just posted, you can just watch this one if you want to see everything that I made in that video. Um, I didn't really crochet in the video, it was more like a chit chat, more preparing for my first fashion show. So go ahead and check that out if you do want to see that. I also made this section of my room and got my first camera, which I'm filming on right now. And I also crocheted with Jean for the first time, which you'll also see in this video. So first things first, I have this hat that I made to go with everything that's behind me. But we have the checkerboard here, splash of yellow. We have just the wavy pattern, the groupiness, I don't know. We have checkerboard back here and then the grooviness again. I can wear it on the other side as well, but I like the side with the black and white for the front personally. Everything I made goes with my logo. Shout out to my sister for making my logo. If y'all ever need branding or anything, check her out because she's amazing and I love how my new branding looks right now. This one. Yeah, we have the hook on the sleeve right here. And then the flower, the groovy colors. And then the back is the same. This sleeve has mesh detailing with this like fluffy yarn. And then it also has contrasting, if it can focus, it has contrasting stitches on the edge. To go along with that sweater, I made this striped skirt. Nothing too crazy, but I swear it looks better than a tube when it's actually on. Then we have this crochet puffer. It's a patchwork puffer jacket with some furry yarn on some of the patches. We also have checkerboard, some groovy patterns and everything. More checkerboard, checkerboard. Actually, this is not checkerboard. <laughs> this is the groovy pattern as well. And then just more patches on the back. Then we have this cardigan. This is probably my favorite thing. Honestly, I love everything I made, but I really like this one too. It has HB on the sleeve, mixed in with these swirlies for Hook by Brianna. And then on this side is more colorful. It has the checkerboard that has the yellow and the orange and the purple. I'm obsessed with it. And then we have the back which has a little distressing right here. Girl with the afro, and then this 3D cloud. It also has the rainbow going up here, and it has the teal border just to tie everything together. I also have this mini skirt that I made and it has the checkerboard, swirlies, swirlies, more checkerboard. We also have checkerboard on the sides here and then stripes on this side. We have this mesh top to go with that skirt. It also has the stripe checkerboard detailing on the bottom. It also has like the swoopiness right here and it also has it on the back with the mesh. Then we just have this green square cardigan made with blanket yarn rather than normal yarn. It is like the long ones I usually make. We have just the big green square on the back. I did do the sleeves. Like a little shorter, they're still full sleeve, but all of my other sleeves are longer. And it also has the stripes on the bottom of the sleeve. Then 
lastly, we have the crochet jean pants, well, crochet jeans, which are right here. I made them like an ombre and then go back to the dark blue. I thought that was really cool. So yeah, this is what they look like. I love how they turned out. It was a horrible experience though. Um, I literally had like jean snot coming out of my nose when I was making it, so I wouldn't recommend doing it. Probably not in your room. If you do do it, wear a mask because after like the hour or two, I had to put on my glasses and my mask because I was coughing up a storm from all the jean particles. Every time I pick them up, it still has some particles coming out, but it's definitely not as bad as it was before. Comment down below what your favorite piece was that I made this month. Again, we're pretending everything was from January because I do not count February 3rd and February 2nd as February. So yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video with someone you think may enjoy it, may need some inspiration for their crochet work, or you just like seeing everything that I make each month.